All right, welcome back to LearnWire, and this will be a rare short video. It's going to be a follow-up to my last video where I did a workflow with Content Pace and Copy AI. I created content and optimized it right in front of you using the tools that we're actually reviewing and then seeing if they actually work. Uh, I thought I was going to have to wait up maybe three days up to a week uh, to get results for you guys. But my article is actually ranking in the top 10 in Google and it started ranking at around the 12 hour mark. So it only took about 12 hours for it to get a page one ranking uh, for a keyword that actually does get search volume. It has some search traffic. Uh, not a whole lot. It's not a, it's, this isn't like a major competitive keyword, but it just shows you that what is possible and shows you that you, if you optimize and you use these tools, um, that, uh, I'm just proving time and time again that you can rank, uh, artificial intelligence, AI content, and then you can use these optimization tools to give you even a, a, a better edge and, and increase your chances. Uh, to rank that content. So um, like I said, one of the biggest arguments or I guess uh, controversies is that Google is uh, considering this AI content spam or whatever you want to call it. The problem is, is that the content is so good that you can't really tell if it's human written or not. And there are some uh, AI detection tools out there, but um, <clears throat> at this point you can almost ignore that fact because um, uh, I have so much content ranking with so many different AI softwares that they're still ranking, even though they um, may um, hold a 100% AI detection in uh, tools like uh, Originality right over here, right? So um, I believe that this is the the 52% original score that I got from the content that I'm going to be talking about today. But this is Content Pace, and uh, we also used uh, Copy AI. I'll leave links uh, to those two softwares below. Um, and basically, if you didn't watch my video from before, it was actually from yesterday. So today is January 13th, 2023. It's from my video from January 12th of 2023, just the video before this one. And you'll be able to get all the data. Uh, go watch that one, because that one goes over, over how I created the content using these two tools. And then I went and asked actually published it on my site. Uh, we'll go over there and we'll actually check it out. Actually, no, I'll just show you the re uh, results right now. So let's go over here and let's open an incognito window right over here. And we can go and type in uh, how to make money selling uh, tumblers right here. So make money, how to make money selling tumblers. I'm going to push enter right here and you can see that it's video heavy. So this is also one of those tricks that if the first uh, few results are video, that means that YouTube is favored, uh, favoring video for this particular keyword over, um, you know, uh, text written content blog posts, but we're going to come down here and I also have a people also ask right there as well. But we're going to scroll through and let's see, I'm literally on page one right there. Look right here, guys. <clears throat> if we ignored these three and the people's also ask, let's see, we're at one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We're ranked to number seven with text content. And I guess if you uh, considered all re results, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, we're ranked number ten. And look at this. It was published one day ago. You can see this is proof right here. People continue to ask. I guess it's just people that have not seen my content and have not seen my videos. But um, I, um, there are so many people that make all these review videos, but they don't, don't actually go out and test the tools on their sites. They're, and they're not, you know, it's they're doing reviews on the stuff, but then they're not even willing to actually have a test uh, website to actually show you results to see if the software actually works. Well, right in front of you, I built the article using AI, um, didn't really do anything um, to it as far as, you know, human interjection, if you will, um, really just took the content and published it on my site, added a few images, added some internal links, added a, an external link, and boom, uh, within one day, this was already ranking right here, it's fully optimized. And we can go check it out on realisticpay.com. Just publish this content with copy AI and content pace. Wanted to show you this <clears throat> right here um, that it was published on January 12th and updated on January 12th. Uh, so one day ago, and you can go and check this out. Uh, this is the article right here, uh, well optimized. 
I showed you how I built this using those two softwares. So go check out that workflow uh, right there. I think I might have too many ads on the site. I need to go and adjust that. There's probably a few too many ads. I need to, uh, to work on that. But I uh, just wanted to get this result, result video out there that, you know, maybe if you're watching this in a week or two or a month, maybe I, who knows, maybe I won't be holding that top 10 ranking or maybe I still will. Um, but th this just shows you that this content can get picked up very quickly and you can rank on page one. So uh, if you want to go and check out Content Pace, uh, pick this lifetime deal up and basically it's a software that will allow you right here how to make money selling tumblers, right? So I went in and I created the con the the article brief. And we'll come over here to content briefs. Actually, that was in my other account. <laughs> Long story short, go watch that other video. Uh, but we created the content brief and then we went and did the content audit right over here in my new content paste account, the one that I paid for. Um, and then we can go and you can look at the report. And this is where it's going to tell us where we are at with all the different um, SEO stats. And then we went in and we looked at the optimization and here's where I use the tool. I actually use the tool to optimize the content and then went and pasted it back on my site. See, added some links right there. One other thing I guess in this video that I will say is that I learned that if you uh, come through and you highlight something, you actually do get a bar right here where you can do um, bullets and make it an H2, H3, H4 bold. You can uh, put uh, numbered lists or bullet points. And you can also, let's see over here, if I push return, you can actually add images. So this is where you would go and add an image from your computer or add from your stock. Um, and this is where you'd go and add. So uh, I know that I was confused on that earlier from ye yesterday's video, but you are able to fully manage your content uh, inside of here. So what did I do? I went through and let's see, is there a back button? No, but you'll see that we achieved a 80 score right here. And I believe it's the highest scored um, on the page as well. No backlinks, no nothing. Within 24 hours, we're able to get on page one for the keyword. Um, so you can see all the green check marks right here. Um, I added in all these keywords that I could. <clears throat> Some of them are over optimized. So I'm thinking that if I do remove those, that it might move the optimization score up a little bit. Um, and then I did also go to the on page tab right over here. And look, every single thing is green right here. I did everything that it told me to do. And every single one of those is fully optimized in green. Went and published it on my site. <clears throat> and again, here's the content on my site and it is ranked on page one right here, how to make money selling tumblers come through and boom, page one ranking right there. So I don't know what else to tell you guys. These tools work if you use them the right way. Um, no backlinks, no nothing. Couldn't even get a backlink indexed if I wanted to within 24 hours, the content is ranking top 10. So, um, I didn't think this video would actually go this long, but, um, you know, I hope that this helps motivate you to go and utilize these tools. I think that this shows that this, there's something to content pace. Um, obviously it works. Um, you know, I'd have to do another test. Um, uh, I, you know, I, I do have to, um, be honest that I've created content with, um, copy AI and then ranked it on page one without, um, using neuron writer or content pacer or, you know, surfer or phrase. So you don't even have to, these, these, the copy AI, um, the quality is pretty good that you can rank content even without, um, using the optimization tools. But I think that if you want that added touch and you really want to make sure that you have strong content, <clears throat> I think that that's where these content optimization tools come in like neuron writer and like content paste. So, um, you know, from based on, um, the fact that I've already gotten page one rankings using uh, content pace, um, I definitely can recommend it. I think that the workflow is great for, um, outsourcing it to writers, or if you're writing the content, like I did myself with the AI content, you can come back and you can actually audit the content. I also also, uh, think that you, there's um, a better workflow, uh, not a better workflow, but uh, if you're creating brand new content and content pace, uh, that there's a way that you can uh, do that as well. I'll make more videos on it. But overall, very happy to see that page one ranking in less than 24 hours. Um, and just wanted to show this a little case study for you guys and show you the real results of ranking content 
um, on page one very quickly with AI content and with these content optimization tools. So if you want to go pick up any of these tools um, at the time of this recording, Content Pace is available at a lifetime deal. I recommend going and picking it up. Um, and that's the biggest question. If you have Neuron Writer, do you need Content Pace? No, absolutely not. Without even making a comparison video, I, um, I'll just be honest with you. You don't need both tools. Um, some of us in this community, uh, many of you that are uh, LearnWire subscribers and watch most of my content, um, we're all kind of in this together we love buying these SEO software tools, right? Whether it's a AI software to create content, whether it's a content optimization tool, whether it's a keyword research tool or SEO tool, whatever it is, uh, we're, we're a little obsessed. We're kind of addicts with uh, buying these tools. I'm not going to lie. Um, I think it's a lot of fun. I love buying these tools. I think it's fun to use them. And, um, you know, it, it's kind of like when people like cars, they go out and get a new car. They, uh, you know, sometimes they buy another second or third car. They don't really need the other car, but they really like cars. And that's why they're buying new cars. Kind of like that with the software. You know, I have so many different pieces of software I don't need anymore, um, but um, it doesn't stop me from buying more because I, I enjoy doing these reviews. I enjoy bringing update videos for you guys and so forth. So that, I hope that answers your question. If you're tight on a budget and you already have Neuron Writer, you already stacked three codes or something, there's nothing in Content Base that um, is standing out that I would say that it's better than Neuron Writer. Um, Neuron Writer is uh, just amazing uh, software. Uh, so I can right off the bat just say, no, if you're on a tight budget, go with Neuron Writer. It does everything and then some. Uh, but Content Pace is a great addition, I think, um, and it can serve a different purpose, I think, as well. Um, so I will, uh, you want to subscribe because I will come out with another video and it will actually be Content Pace um, versus Neuron Writer. We'll do a comparison. We'll probably take the same keyword. We'll optimize it in both. We'll see what the scores say um, and just kind of do a little, little bit of testing. But overall, I've test I've tested both out now, and I've gotten page one rankings with both softwares. So we can't really say. Um, and right off the bat, thirty eight five star reviews with Content Pace. They're on a very fast pace uh, to get a lot of reviews and have a lot of success on AppSumo. So um, it's a great software. I would if you have the budget for it, uh, it's not it's not going to hurt you to go pick up uh, one code or or multiple codes. All right, I will see you guys in the next video.